<laughs> Actually, um, can you tell me what the uh, student to faculty ratio is here? Uh, the exact number, I'm not sure, but it's, I know it's pretty low. It's probably like 15 to 1. That's my guess. Hi, can I ask a question? I'm a college counselor. Can you tell me what the faculty-student ratio is here? Like, uh, I think it's like 1 to 10. Like 16 to 1. 1 to 10, 16 to 1. Do you have any idea? I have no idea. It's, it's better than most colleges. Very small. Um, so can you tell me, either can either one of you tell me the um, the faculty-student ratio here? Uh, last I checked, there was something about, something between 15 and 18 to 1. 15 and 18 to 1. Is that good? Yeah, it's actually, it's very good for, it, it's about on par for a liberal arts college size. Great. Just based on statistics I read when looking for colleges. But. Uh, you know, faculty-student ratio is a st statistic that people use to gauge the quality of the educational experience at any college. But, you know, uh, it's a statistic that is very easily manipulated. It's very uh, fuzzy, and it has some unintended consequences if you focus on it too much. So uh, there are better questions to ask if you want to get a bead on the educational quality of a college. Do you, uh, can you tell me the faculty-student ratio here at this college? Uh, it's like 15 to 1, I think. 15 to 1. Yeah. Okay, is that like 20? Yeah, it's, it's, pretty, it's a lot to a little. No, I have no idea. No idea what the faculty-student <laughs> ratio is. What's Thanks. the faculty-student ratio at, here at McAllister? Um, I'd say like 10 to 1 maybe? I'm not real sure. One of the unintended consequences of having a low student-to-faculty ratio is that sometimes students can get locked out of the classes that they really want to take. So, are you asking the right questions? What's the faculty-student ratio here? I would say, off the top of my head, yeah, 15 sorry. to 1. 15 to 1. Okay. Um, is that good? Sure. <laughs> I don't know. I've never been anywhere else. Um, yeah, I think it's pretty good. You know, understanding faculty workload is, is really important. You need to know uh, things like how many courses does each faculty member teach every year? How many students do they teach every year? How much of their time is spent on research and how many dollars do they receive for getting for their research support? The nuances of these questions are much more important than, understand, than understanding the simplistic ratio of faculty to student ratio.